A major event is expected to draw thousands to Dorothea Dix Park in downtown Raleigh tomorrow. Yeah, we've been telling you about Destination Dix for months now. The festival marks the one-year anniversary of the sale by the state to the city. CBS North Carolina's AJ Janabelle is live at the park tonight with a preview of what to expect. Hi, AJ. Hey, Sharon. Hey, Maggie. Now, it doesn't look like a lot right now. You can see it's uh, pretty dark, but they are getting set up. And like you guys said, tomorrow morning around 10 o'clock, they're expecting there to be a lot more people out here. And there's going to be a lot going on. They have two music stages. They have food, arts and crafts. There's even a Ferris wheel back there. But one thing the city is hoping that they get out of this park is a little bit of input from the people who come out tomorrow. Now, as you mentioned, Sharon, this park was bought last year about that time. The 300-acre plot of land was bought for $52 million. And as of right now, the city still doesn't have a set plan for what this area will be. So they're hoping that they'll get a little input from the people that come out tomorrow. They want this park to be a namesake for the Raleigh area. One thing, though, that they are prepared for and expecting tomorrow is it's going to be super hot, dangerously hot even, and they want people to stay safe and to stay cool. We've got a 6,000-gallon tanker coming, so we will not run out of water. We've got watermelon stations to go along with the water, um, misting tents, cooling areas. Wake Med will do a has a dehydration station set up, so we will keep people cool and keep people happy out here. So if you're planning on coming out tomorrow, the whole event is free. It goes from 10 o'clock in the morning to 7 o'clock at night. However, if you are coming out, you're going to have to find a way to get here. Other than parking here, the city will have shuttles back and forth. We have a lot more information about everything that's going on here tomorrow, as well as shuttles and all of that online at WNCN.com. And as I mentioned before, it's going to be really hot and probably with a little bit more than just really hot. Uh, we have Wes right now. All right, AJ, uh, great thing about that park, uh, all the trees, and that will help.